All right, students, it is week number six. So in this week, we are going to read all of Psalms and Lamentations. So get after it this week. You got a lot of reading to do. Uh, when you've done that, you read the article on Psalms and the article on Lamentations. And when you've done that, then you read the article on Wisdom and Covenant. That's a lot of reading. Um, once you have done all of that, you still need to do your discussion forum post. And as always, initial post due Wednesday before midnight. Uh, your responses are due Saturday before midnight. And this week you also have a contextualized application track assignment. And this one requires you to do one of those three tracks again. Um, this particular assignment uh, is going to deal with Psalms. And so for the pastor track, you're going to pick one of the imprecatory Psalms. If you don't know what that is, look it up in your dictionary. Um, you're going to use this psalm to prepare a set of notes to counsel someone who's going through a situation described there in the course. Uh, pay attention to your specific ministry context and the pastoral needs of your congregation and the psalm's relevance to that. So I would expect this to take, um, like the assignment says, about 800 words. If you are doing the teacher track, again, same length, 800-ish words, um, you need to ab develop five objection, five objectives for a lesson plan on Psalm 119 uh, over that entire psalm that adequately covers the ideas uh, and give a rationale for each objective. So kind of a, an objective with a rationale, and then each one of those should demonstrate that you understand the psalm. Each rationale should be a paragraph in length. So more than two sentences is a paragraph. So think three to four at least. Uh, the visual presentation element should be detailed but not overwhelming and uh, should have a driving point. Now, the final option here would be the scholar track. You're going to develop some notes for an article. So it uh, doesn't have to be uh, completely... Um, article-esque here. This is notes, so a couple of paragraphs on different things. Um, you need to give one psalm for each classification. So give me an, a classification such as imprecatory psalm, Psalm 137, and then you explain what features of that psalm make it an imprecatory psalm. So uh, that is what we need to do. Um, you need to describe the different types of psalms there. Okay, so again, uh, you've done all of those things. You have looked over your criteria for success to make sure you do a really excellent job and get the grade that you want. Uh, and you're going to do a good job if you do that.